wireless video systems are a must-have accessory for some work. They allow you to have monitors for clients, directors, focus pullers that can be placed anywhere on set without the need to run actual cables from the camera as that can obviously just slow you down massively, especially on location-based work. Most people that we talk to though assume that wireless video comes at a premium price, which may well have been the case a few years ago, but now we are seeing more and more affordable options popping up on the market. Some are of course better than others, but one of the options out there that I think is really worth sharing because it's hit the middle ground between its low cost and professional performance is the Flow system from Swit. So, there are currently two versions of the Flow. The Flow 500, which has a range of 500 feet with line of sight, and the Flow 2000, which has a range of 2000 feet, again with line of sight. Both the 500 and the 2000 can transmit a 1080p signal up to 60 frames a second, and they operate within the 5 gigahertz spectrum and automatically jump between wireless channels to get the best possible signal. That means you'll have a much more stable connection between the two units than on some of the cheaper wireless systems out there. And this is a true 5 gigahertz wireless signal with official DFS scanning, an important feature to meet those UK regulations for wireless, rather than the cheaper Wi-Fi technology like on some of the lower priced competing products, which often actually don't meet those regulations and can actually be unreliable. Other than the range, there aren't really any other differences between the features on the Flow 500 and 2000. Both can be powered off of MPF batteries or DTAP cables or mains through that locking DC input. Both the transmitter and the receiver are really nice and compact as well and have two SDI ports and one HDMI port on them. So on the transmitter, that's a HDMI and SDI input and an SDI loop through for sending the signal actually through to another on-camera monitor, for example. And on the receiver, both SDI ports are outputs, as is the HDMI port. And what's great to see is that you can cross convert as well. So you can input a HDMI signal into the transmitter and get an SDI signal out of the receiver. So you're not limited to which cameras and which monitors you need to use. It's much more flexible. And when it comes to usability, the flow is actually really simple to use, which is really quite refreshing for wireless video, as most systems, especially those cheaper ones, but even the higher end Teradek units at times can be frustratingly fiddly. All you need to do for the switch is give each unit power, plug a cable in, and you're pretty much good to go in most situations. If they're already paired, they'll just pair up quickly and automatically. There are status LEDs on the side to show a link between two units and if a video signal is actually being received or not. And there's also a status screen on the front so that you can see the status of the unit and manually switch between channels if you need to using the joystick. So it's always very obvious and quick to see what exactly is going on with your wireless system. And this screen is also where you pair the units together should they become unpaired. Now it might sound like a small thing, but I really like the fact that you can do this through the menu and not through a fiddly button that can only be pushed with a paper clip like on some other wireless systems out there. It just makes the process much easier and quicker to do when you're in a rush on set. One other feature I'm really glad to see, especially considering its price point, is multicasting. You can pair one transmitter to up to four receivers. And this can be any combination of Flow 500 or 2000 or any future models that they might bring out as well. You're not just limited to one lineup. So you can have a Flow 2000 transmitter on your camera, a Flow 500 receiver on your focus pullers monitor right next to the camera, and say two or three Flow 2000 receivers for directors, client monitors, video village, anything that needs to be further away, all driven from that one transmitter on one camera. Like I said at the start of this video, I do think Switch have hit the nail on the head and that sweet spot here between price features and performance, especially when you compare it out to other wireless systems on the market. Now, we're currently working on a comparison video looking at their performance compared to the market leader, Teradek. So keep an eye out for that video. But in the meantime, it'd be great to hear what you all think of the Switch flow. Is this something that you'd consider for your work or would you go for those higher cost Teradeks? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thanks very much for watching. And if you want to buy one of these for yourself, of course, just head over to provi.co.uk. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.